Hi, I'm Jason Burhill from Brexit TV, and I'm here today to talk with Noel Cunningham. It was around this time last year when I first met Noel. Back then, at 84, we thought you might well be the oldest person in the world still working with CAD. Well, no one has come forward to challenge this claim, so at 85, I'm assuming you are, officially, the world's oldest CAD operator. Do you think CAD's changed the way that people produce drawings? Do people produce better drawings now because they're using CAD or...? Well, some people produce better drawings. Some people produce a whole sheet of blocks which they've got stored somewhere uh, of things that you're not even interested in because they look nice. So here was a guy who was charged with making a drawing that was going to be useful. He made a drawing which looked pretty but it was completely useless. Not only was it useless, it was uh, it, it cost the guy hours of work and waste of material. So, <clears throat> I don't, I'm not offering to train all CAD operators, but I mean, they should be licensed like car drivers. They should, be <laughs> they should prove they understand what they're doing before you let them at it. So, um, what brought you to BricsCAD. So you started out with AutoCAD, but you ended up with BricsCAD. Well, for value for money, you can't go past BricsCAD. AutoCAD got very, very sort of, um, a bit like Windows. It got, they wanted to regulate your life. And they really took it beyond the, um, the ordinary one-man draftsman. I mean, you can't afford to pay the money they wanted. <clears throat> and um, so I've always looked around for something else. I tried out some IntelliCAD CAD or something like that. But I just stumbled upon this Bricks CAD online. And I thought, well, this does the job. And value for money, it's great. <laughs>